I just want to make sure you are you good? Dada never did nothing to anybody, right? Mama never did nothing to me. Dada never did nothing to mama, right? Everything's everything is safe. Have we not have we, have dada put hands on mama or mama put hands on dada? No, right? Okay, so there's no reason to call the police, right? We're just making a movie. We're just playing. Ray J might be seeing the inside of a jail cell sooner than we thought after his seven-year-old daughter called the cops on him for putting his hands on Princess Love. To make matters even worse, he was also caught on camera intimidating the little girl who made the call to the police and trying to gaslight her into recanting her statement. Apparently, Ray J has been putting his hands on Princess Love for some years now, and this is one of the reasons that she left him and got a new man. He allegedly put his hands on Princess a lot around their kids, but this time, the whooping he was giving Princess was so brutal that his kids thought she wasn't gonna make it out alive, and that's why they called the cops on him to get him arrested. Chow, we out here thinking that the constant cheating was the only thing that Princess had to deal with. Whole time, Sis is getting dragged and whooped in front of her kids too. Now, as most of y'all already know, Ray J and Princess are in the middle of a divorce right now after Princess filed for divorce divorced from him for the fourth and final time. They initially got married in August of 2016 and welcomed their first child, Melody Love, in May of 2018, and then their second, Epic Ray, in January of 2020. Now, not too long after they had Epic, word got to circulating that Ray J and Princess was having issues in their marriage after Princess filed for divorce from Ray J. At the time, Princess said she and Ray J had been having issues that were building for a while now, but what made her really want to clock out from that marriage was when he left her and their daughter stranded in Las Vegas with no care in the world as to how they were going to get back home. After they all flew to Las Vegas together a few days prior for the BET Soul Train Awards. What made the situation even worse was that Princess was heavily pregnant at the time. She called Ray J out by leaving a comment under a family photo that he posted to Instagram thanking BET for inviting him and his family to the award show. Left me and Melody straight stranded in Vegas and blocked me from calling. Now you wanna post family photos? Bye, ugly. But as usual, Ray J tried to gaslight her and make the world think that she's the problem when he, in fact, was the problem. I'm at the Skyloft right now, as you can see, and I just don't understand how somebody can get stranded. If we never left, we, we've been right here. <laughs> you stay right there. People gonna get into little arguments here and there that are small stuff that you can work out. But to take this to social media and create this crazy story about me leaving my baby in harm's way is not cool. Our circle needs to be tight like that and nobody should be able to get in it. If we get into something big or small, we should be able to hug each other and love each other and listen to each other and understand what we need to do to make it right. How can I make adjustments? How can I compromise? to make you happy. It goes both ways in a relationship. This is not it. I apologize for everything that's happening. We supposed to be at the tightest and at the strongest. We having another baby coming in and these are not the things we supposed to do. The devil's working, but he's not working hard enough and he will never work hard enough because my family is something that I will always die for, and the devil ain't ready to do that. With me. Princess did not let this gaslight and slide, and she jumped on IG Live to put him on blast again. She said, practice what you preach. If we've so-called been there the whole time, why would you miss your baby? About two weeks ago, I found a, an extra phone that Ray had been hiding, or that Ray, he wasn't hiding, he had it, and um, he had been giving his number out. He had admitted to me that he was, I found this phone that he had. I went through it. I confronted him about it. He was honest. Well, he tried to lie at first. He was honest. And, um, he basically admitted that he had been entertaining, you know, some women to stay women because my baby's right here. And, you know, I told him, just be honest with me. If, you, if you're honest, we ended up. So we ended up checking out of the hotel because it was time to check out. And then I ended up checking, up checking into another hotel. 
and we're in another hotel right now. We are not where Ray is in the Skylofts. I have not talked to him. He has not unblocked me. He has not called me, hasn't checked on me or Melody. Um, so we're just here. Anyway, it seemed like they resolved whatever issues they was having because Princess later filed for divorce to be dismissed. But don't get too excited because just two months after Princess filed for the dismissal, Ray J pulled the biggest stunt on her when he also filed for divorce. Like, you cannot make this up. But just like Princess, he also filed for the court to dismiss his filing in just a few days. That wasn't until October of 2021 when Ray J decided to file for divorce again again, citing irreconcilable differences. This was just about seven months after he had requested for his first divorce filing to be dismissed in the first place. Apparently, the reason why Ray J wanted to leave Princess is because he was mad at her for leaving him in the hospital while he was battling pneumonia. I've been in here all by myself for a week. No family members came to see me, not even my wife. I thought it was over. I started praying and knew God is good, so I just kept praying. Now, Ray J eventually recovered from this pneumonia and he was able to spend time with his family again. But fast forward to 2022, he and Princess got in a heated argument during an episode of Stomping Grounds. Princess told Ray J she's been messing with other men ever since he filed for divorce, and as you can imagine, he did not take this very well. She said she was tired of him always cheating on her with exotic dancers and escorts who he meets in the club and then coming back home to her like nothing happened. We're done. Okay, we've been done. So we're done. And you're free to do whatever you want. And you're free to continue to talk to whoever you want. Thank because you. Because I already know you talking to Okay. Yeah, okay. You, you wanna go it. talk to other while we in a relationship? You tried to the day we got I, married. No, I did not. Stop lying to yourself. So right? I deserve to get cheated on? No, you cheated on me by talking to some Ray. random no, You talking to three right now. But despite all the back and forth of them literally admitting to cheating on each other, Ray J filed for the divorce to be dismissed again in February of 2023. And just like that, he and Princess were together again. But I'm sure y'all can already imagine they never stopped having problems. Ray J continued to cheat on that woman over and over again, not having a care in the world about how he made her feel. At some point, Princess was tired of the mistreatment and she decided to file for divorce again again. She released an official statement to her IG page where she said, Dear friends and family, it's with heavy hearts that we share the news of our decision to divorce. After much reflection, discussion, and counseling, we've come to the difficult decision that our paths have diverged, and it is in the best interest of both of us to part ways. While our relationship as spouses may be coming to an end, we remain committed to co-parenting our children and maintaining a positive and supportive family dynamic. She even even sparked rumors of potentially having a new man when she popped out with the popular Star Wars actor John Boyega. There were videos of them going around in which he could be seen getting real touchy with her. When Ray J was asked what he thought about this, he seemed really unbothered by the whole thing. And, and was in the bathroom for a while. I you got media takeout. Oh, first thing. <laughs> Well, First according thing. to this top story on here, British oh, actor John Boyega is now dating Ray J's wife, Who, Princess Love. Oh. You know him from The Woman King. The Woman King? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, so that's John Boyega. Okay, you're taking no, your glasses, no glasses off. Glasses. Uh-oh. Okay. Don't, you don't got to look too hard. You good. So they've been allegedly okay. spotted out at a hotspot called Station 1640. And, um, you know, they were sitting together at a table, quote, booed up oh. as well. And okay. so... Got it. So okay. there you you have it. Hold on. Let me... I just want to see. We can see it after, too. Okay. I yeah, we can see, see if it he's after. a good guy. Is he a well, nice he's... guy? Is he like a nerdy guy? Right. You can't look at a picture and see yes, if somebody... Can. Okay. Well, this is oh, this is cool. John Boyega. He's in They Clone Tyrone, The Woman like King. Him. Yeah. Okay. Um, you approve? He's all right? Yeah, because you know you you don't want you don't want you don't want to be with that dude. You know what I'm saying? That's yes. when it's like okay. He needs to be good, solid. If you're gonna he's be around like your good, kids, potentially. Like okay. Oh, Ray J don't approves. Say that. He doesn't want to hear that part yet. What? Not around the kids. Okay. Yet. No, but it's, it, no, it's you know what? It's not like that. I got my kids with me. So okay. my mm -hmm. my son with me. Okay. Okay. And All my right. daughter with, with her because my daughter doing school. She loves school. She don't never want to miss school. 
I love my that. son in That's preschool. Good. I love that for education. Which is like, which is like daycare. <laughs> Why well, go to preschool and you can go to Ray Care? With, with your Ray Care. Ray. <laughs> well, it turns out the reason why he was so unbothered was because he knew Princess wasn't going nowhere. And that's been proven recently when his daughter called the cops on him for putting the paws on Princess. This whole thing went down a few days ago when Ray J went live on his IG to record his kids crying hysterically while begging him to stop physically attacking their mom. Per the conversation that was being had between him and his daughter, it seems like the daughter tried calling the police after she witnessed Ray J physically mistreating Princess. In the IG live, the little girl sounded deeply traumatized while Ray J just tried to gaslight her out of what she saw. Chow, y'all take a look at this mess. And I never did nothing to anybody, right? Mama never did nothing to me. Dad, I never did nothing to mama, right? Mm -hmm. Everything's everything is safe. Mm -hmm. Have we not have we have dad I put hands on mama or mama put hands on dad? No, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so there's no reason to call the police, right? Is it just a movie? We're just making a movie. We're just playing, okay? We can go to my house, but I just want to make sure everything is safe here with Melody and everybody. Go get you a sweater. Go get a sweater and we'll go. But nothing nothing crazy has happened. I got it all on tape. All right, so let's get you some, let's put on your shoes. I gotta leave, baby. I don't want, I don't want anything that, everything's okay. I just wanna make sure everything is safe. I love your mom. Your mom loves me, loves me. No, I love your mom, your mom loves me. It's I just want to keep it documented that nothing is happening and that we're all, we are, we both respect each other and love each other. This was just a pretend thing, okay? We just had an argument, okay? I don't want it to get out of hand and I wanted to make sure it's recorded and seen so we, we're all super safe. Just because somebody has a disagreement doesn't mean anything, you know? Um, calling the police over a disagreement is loud and I'm not with that. Okay? I love you. Your mom loves you. Did you check on your mom? Mm -hmm. Go check on her one more time. Tell her you're going with Dada. Go with, do it one more time and tell her you're going with Dada. Mm -hmm. You have to one more time so she knows you're going with me, okay? That's the right thing to do. Huh? Mm -hmm. We're just going. Judging from how traumatized them kids sound, it's safe to say that this was not the first time that Ray J has put his hands on Princess in front of them. Do y'all know how bad he must have attacked Princess for that little girl to feel the need to call the police on him? Like that man needs to be stopped before he does the unthinkable to Princess. In fact, Princess was not here for this at all and accused Ray J of trying to traumatize, manipulate, and gaslight her kids like he's been doing to her for years. She said, this is the only time I'm going to address this. I've been trying my best to be the bigger person and just walk away peacefully. But what you're not gonna do is traumatize, manipulate, and gaslight my kids when you can't do it to me anymore. I'll save my videos for the judge. Initially, people thought Princess might have gone back to him after filing for a divorce, but judging from what she just said, it don't seem like she's gone back to him. But Ray J, on the other hand, is clearly having a hard time accepting that she's done for good now. And now he's attacking her in front of their kids. As usual, people had their own thoughts about this. Like this person who said, only a narcissist records the aftermath, controls the narrative, and then posts online for validation. The dysfunction and emotional trauma these babies are witnessing at the hands of their parents is wild. Coaching kids to agree with a is dangerous and tells us all we need to know. Everything he's saying didn't happen, did happen. Another person said, ah, the old pretend mental and that's not a black eye. Mommy's just a Dalmatian dog for Halloween. But now I want to know your thoughts. What do y'all think of Ray J gaslighting his kids out of them seeing him putting the paws on Princess? And do y'all think Princess is gonna report him to the police? Y'all then knew what to do. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And don't forget to click here to watch this other very messy video.